Hey, this is David Miller with the Miller Realty Group of Keller Williams Realty, and I'm here to help you get real estate smart. All right, the new stats just came out, and I'm gonna get, um, interpret the data for you and what that means to you and your house and your value. So I look at two things first, the supply and the demand. So if we look at the supply, the inventory of homes, how many homes are currently active on the market, it is still extremely low. Compared to this time last year, it's 14% lower, all right? We only have about 7,700 homes that are on the market. So the supply is very low, especially below $300,000. Now the demand is still very high for two reasons. Even though the interest rates have uh, gone up a little bit, they're at 4.64 versus 4.51 from the previous month, that is still real low. It is still very low. And so that's driving demand. And the other thing that's driving demand is that school just got out. So that's, this is prime time on when buyers are out looking for homes before school starts again and everybody's situated so it doesn't cause a, a big ruckus when they're moving when school is in session. So demand is still very high. Inventory is very low. And because of that, we're still getting really good appreciation on the houses. So the median appreciation price compared to last year went up 7% last month, all right? So that's still very positive and very strong. Now, what we're also seeing is that the low inventory is actually affecting sales in a negative manner. Sales are actually down 11% versus this time last year. So it's not because of the high demand, it's because the low supply. There's not a lot, a lot of homes out there that, that are for sale. So what does this mean to you? Well, if you are looking to purchase a house, now more than ever, you need to make sure that you are working with the right realtor. Because if you're working with a realtor that just puts you on a search and tells you that when you find something you like, give me a call and I got that magic key to let you in, by the time you get to that property, it's either gonna be already under contract or it's gonna have multiple offers. So make sure you're working with a realtor that can find those properties before they hit the market because if you can find them before they hit the market, you're gonna be the first one up before the other 14,000 realtors and their buyers find out about it. So anyways, that's what's going on in the market. Hope you are able to get real estate smarter and we'll be in touch. Thanks.